Hey everyone, how's it going? Thanks so much for tuning in. For today's video, we're going to be taking an in-depth look into the all-new 2022 Chevrolet Silverado 2500 work truck. Now this particular vehicle over here is actually the regular cab and it's equipped with a work truck convenience package and it's also got the standard 6.6 .6 liter V8 gas engine and it's also connected to a 6 speed automatic transmission. My goal with this review is to teach you guys everything you ever wanted to know about the Silverado 2500 from pricing, what it's all about and so much more. I also like to extend a big thanks and special shout out to Lakeshore Motors for providing this opportunity today. For more information about their dealership, including their contact info and inventory, please feel free to check out their website provided in the description box below. So without further ado, let's go and start her up and let it run. The exterior color on the Silverado is finished off in a black exterior featuring jet black cloth interior. Gotta love that amazing sound from that 6.6 .6 liter V8 gas engine. Now the Silverado 2500 HD does feature two different transmission choices available for 2022, depending on which engine you get. If you're up for the optional 6.6 .6 liter Duramax diesel engine, you get a 10 speed automatic and it's also shared with the Silverado 3500 HD as well as the GMC Sierra heavy duty trucks. But if you're up for the standard 6.6 .6 liter V8 gas engine, this one's powered by GM's Hydromatic 6-speed automatic gearbox with manual shiftability, plus and minus on the shift column if you want to shift it manually. Now back in 2014, General Motors designed the, the tow home mode button over here that raises the shift points for better performance while towing. But instead, for 2022, they designed this button over here, which is the tow home mode switch over here. And it's pretty cool. And when you put the vehicle in reverse, your integrated backup camera appears with guidance lines and they automatically adjust as you turn the wheel. Alright, so anyways, we're going to go ahead and flip on the headlights. It does have automatic lights, as well as the hazards. Now the Silverado 2500 HD work truck does have the automatic driver side window over here. And we'll check out the exterior, shall we? Now the Silverado 2500 HD does have two different engine choices available for 2022. One is the 6.6 .6 liter Duramax diesel engine and this particular standard 6.6 .6 liter V8 gasoline engine which will produce to 401 horsepower at 5200 rpm and 464 foot-pounds of torque at 4000 rpm. Really nice. Now the Silverado 2500 HD work truck does feature a Chevrolet Infotainment 3 7 inch diagonal color touchscreen with additional features for compatible phones include Bluetooth audio streaming, voice command pass through to phone, Android Auto and Apple CarPlay capable. On the touchscreen over here you can go to home here, personalize your settings, go to the settings menu there, time and date, language, display there, sounds, Back to audio, really cool. You do have your climate control over here. You can change the blower fan speed, change all the different zones over here. It does have front and rear defrost over here, AC, and recirculating air. Now you do have your tailgate button over here. That's to open the tailgate there. And your hazard switch like you saw earlier, and your traction off button there. That turns on, activated by this button there. And down below you got your trailer brake control over here, your integrated trailer brake control, and your USB ports over here, and your 12 volt power outlet. It does have cruise control located over here, it's activated by the button. You have your four wheel drive switch over here, and your 
tow haul mode switch there that raises the shift points for better performance while towing. And down below you have your electronic parking brake down below. You push to engage and it'll tell you if it's on. Parking brake is set. And then hold your foot on the brake and then push it again and it'll just release the parking brake. It's that simple. So let's just say you get two occupants inside this truck and if you want to get like three occupants inside this truck you pull this up and you get an extra seat over here. Room for three people inside this truck. Now if you turn this little knob down below, this happens, you get a digital speedometer there, trip one, trip two, fuel range right there, tire pressure, remaining oil life, air filter life, brake pad life, and transmission fluid temperature, trailer brakes, engine hours, metric, you name it. It's really cool. Alrighty. We'll go shut her down. And we'll check out the tailgate. So now I'm going to show you how to open this tailgate over here with the key fob. If you want to open it, you just press this button twice. And it opens it like that really nice or you can open it with this little switch there you push it and it comes down like that pretty cool now we'll check out the passenger you got this little handle there you just pull yourself in it's really cool you have your glove box over here. There's two. There's one over here and one over here. You got your instructions guide over here along with your block heater cable or something like that. Block heater cord. Really cool. Now the tire sizes on this truck are actually LT265 70 or 17s including the front and rear all-terrain tires by Firestone. It's really cool. So this truck does have a auto-locking rear differential and as well as a electronic transfer case, 170 amp alternator, independent front suspension, multi-leaf rear spring suspension, stability track with trailer sway control, and hill start assist, trailering package with hitch guidance. Now the gross weight for this truck is actually rated at 4,649 kilograms which is 10,250 pounds and the rear axle ratio for this truck is actually 3.73 it's really cool well everyone I hope you enjoy my review on the all new 2022 Chevrolet Silverado 2500 HD work truck be sure to stay tuned next time for more videos just like this and remember like subscribe favorite don't forget to check out my other videos as always be sure to stay tuned next time there's always a lot more where it came from take care